it this way. Um, I've made, I mixed my colors, and uh, this is a yellow mix and the green mix. This is a red, um, red violet mix one and two, rose mix one and two, and on down. I have burnt umber and raw sand on my palette too. So uh, we're going to start out with extender as always. And we're going to start with the um, large daisy. So I'm going to put extender on. I'm going to set my palette over to this side. So we're going to begin with the dark areas, and um, we're going to begin with raw sienna, brush mixed with a little burnt umber. And when you're finished, do not clean your brush. So let's put some raw sienna and some burnt umber. And I'm going to mix that together. I think I might get a little more raw sienna. Okay. Now looking at our pictures, we're looking at picture 37 and this is what we're going to do with uh, our brush load. So I know that I've got this one is dark and put a, some darks here, we're going to put it in there, we're going to put it in all of our dark areas. And we're also going to put it in our back area. I'm going to leave that one off. Okay, it's a little more. Now what we're doing is adding the shading on this daisy. Okay. Now we're going to move over to this picture 38. Now I'm not cleaning my brush and I'm going to pick up the yellow mix and the Naples yellow mix. I'm going to overstroke some of this and some of our dead layer is going to be visible still. So with my dirty brush I'm going to pick up the yellow mix and the Naples yellow mix. And I'm going to mix those on my palette. See, we still have some of the, the dark in there. Now I'm just going to overstroke. Should have done that one this way. Okay. Now I can put additional glazes on here. Um, and I will. I'm going to let some of this set in. And I, I'll even let it dry. 
and then I'll come back over with the, some yellow again. But let's move on to the center. I missed the pedal. Okay, let's move on to the center. We're going to dab in the center with our dirty brush, and we're going to start with the raw sienna and burnt umber. And pinch wipe the excess out of my brush, but I'm not cleaning it. Go back to our dark mix of raw sienna and burnt umber and brush mix that. And then we're going to pounce the center. Yeah, it says dab, but pounce is the same thing. And then with raw sienna in the middle area, And then we're going to go back to that mix of uh, Naples yellow and the yellow mix. And we're going to get the light area with that. And looking at our photo, the light area uh, is to towards the bottom, towards this leaf. So. Put that right there. Okay? And we're going to leave that alone and it can uh, uh, kind of dry down a little bit. I want to, got a hard line here. And then we'll put some more glazes on it. But we're going to move next to the um, carnation. And so we're going to move to picture 39. We're going to paint this loosely, not, not a lot of realism, just loosely. So to put some dark in it, let's brush mix our naphthol red with dark gray value 3. So I'm going to put naphthol red on my palette and also the gray 3. doing a lot of brush mixing so I'm putting them on my palette so that I don't have to continually uh, put them out. So let's brush mix some naphthol red and some gray. And I think I'd like to have a little more of the naphthol red in there. just a little too toned. Okay, let's come back over here, put on our extender. And let's just glaze some dark in. Okay, 